I'm Wolf Blitzer. We're here in the CNN Election Center for comprehensive analysis of tonight's second debate between President Obama and former Governor Mitt Romney, the debate moderated by CNN's Candy Crowley. The biggest verbal clash of the night came when uh, Romney accused the president of waiting too long to call the September 11th attack on the United States consulate in Benghazi, Libya, an act of terror. The president said Romney simply had his facts wrong. Watch this. The day after the attack, Governor, I stood in the Rose Garden and I told the American people and the world that we were going to find out exactly what happened, that this was an act of terror, and I also said that we're going to hunt down those who committed this crime. And then a few days later, I was there greeting the caskets coming into Andrews Air Force Base and grieving with the families. And the suggestion that anybody in my team, whether the Secretary of State, our UN ambassador, anybody on my team would play politics or mislead when we've lost four of our own governor is offensive. That's not what we do. That's not what I do as president. That's not what I do as commander in chief. Governor, if you want to reply yeah, just I, I quickly I to this, do. please. I, I, I think it's interesting. The president just said something, which, which is that on the day after the attack, he went to the Rose Garden and said that this was an act of terror. You said in the Rose Garden, the day after the attack, it was an act of terror. It was not a spontaneous demonstration. Is that what you're saying? Please proceed, Governor. I, I, I want to make sure we get that for the record, because it took the president 14 days before he called the attack in Benghazi an act of terror. Get the transcript. It, 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 he did, in, in fact, sir. So let me, let me call it an act of Can terror. Can you say that a little louder, Candy? He, used the word. He, he did call it an act of terror. It did as well take it did as well uh, take uh, two weeks or so uh, for the whole idea of there being a riot out there about this tape uh, to come out. You're the, correct this, about that. The administration, the administration <laughs> indicated that this was a, a reaction to a, to a video and was a spontaneous reaction. They did. It took them a long time to say this was a terrorist act by a terrorist group. And, and to suggest, am I incorrect in that regard? On, on Sunday, the, uh, your, your secretary, your, excuse me, the uh, ambassador of the United Nations, one of the Sunday t television shows, and, and spoke about how Candy, this was a spontaneous I'm reaction. Happy, I'm happy me, to I, have a longer conversation about foreign absolutely, policy. Absolutely, but I want, I want to move you on, and okay, also I'm people to can that go too. to the... Lively exchange there. Uh, the results are in from our poll of registered voters who watched this second debate. Here's the headline. 46% say President Obama won tonight compared to 39% who say Governor Romney won. Uh, we also have some brand new numbers just coming in. We asked uh, who would uh, better handle the issue of foreign policy. 49% said President Obama, compared to 47% for Governor Romney. We asked, if uh, President Obama offered a clear plan for solving the country's problems, 38% of debate watchers said yes, 61% said no.